Hello my budget beauty queens. Welcome to Beauty on a Budget where affordability meets elegance. If you are seeing me for the first time, hello. Hi, you are most welcome. So we are going to be doing cornrows, achieving neat cornrows on like raw hair. It, the hair is not blown is not blown out. It is not stretched. Yes, and no gel. So I start by applying leave-in conditioner in my hair and comb or detangle my hair really well. So the first thing to achieving neat cornrows is well detangled hair. And you know why? It is because you're going to get a painless cornrow experience. Okay, and who doesn't want that? Girl! So yes, I am sectioning my hair and I'm going to be doing small cornrows. So small sections yield smaller cornrows and big sections yield bigger cornrows. And if you are a beginner, I would advise to start with small, small cornrows because the hair is like manageable. Small sections are like manageable. So yes, we start by sectioning the front hair into three sections and we start braiding. The normal way we do braids three strand braids is the normal way we braid here but at this time around girl we are braiding on the scalp so what do we do we use index fingers to scoop hair from the back so you scoop from the back as you bring to the front using your index fingers and the other fingers help with like putting the hair at the back so you scoop bring to the front as you bring to the back you know you keep interchanging the way you do a rope the way you do a three strand conro yes and the second thing girl is the gripping girl make tight grips i don't mean like too tight where your head is going to scream for help no i mean a reasonable amount of tight yes so grip tight tighter grips yield neater or tight cornrows whereas loose grips yield loose cornrows you know those cornrows that look like they are three months old or two months old mm -mm, girl we don't want that so your grip your hair really tight yes so that you get neat cornrows yes so if you haven't considered subscribing to my channel please consider subscribing beauty on a budget embracing beauty without the hefty price tag and on this channel we celebrate self-love self-care humble beginnings and smart spending so join the movement and discover beauty on a budget that works for you So subscribe to my channel, tap on the notification bell so that you do not miss out on any new video. And if you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Yes. So, so far, I hope you can see how the cornrows really look. They really look good to me without gel. And I don't really think we need to be using gel on every hairstyle. No head to the gel. I'm just saying not on like every hairstyle you do. You don't need a gel. Yes, I think gel should be applied to specific hairstyles because of the way it like uh, sits on the scalp causing product build up. I think the scalp sometimes needs... Um, a break from the gel it needs like should i say to breathe yeah so yes you can really achieve neat hairstyles neat cornrows neat neat hairstyles without gel yes and that is just my opinion these are my first two cornrows and i hope you can see how neat they look they are not really they don't really look bad yes So my only advice, like this is something you, I want you to really focus on when you're doing cornrows, is your gripping. Yes, 
I don't mean tight gripping whereby your head is going to scream uh, but I mean a reasonable amount of tight yes so make sure you don't grip your head too tight but like grip tight but not too tight I hope that makes sense yes Oh, this is 2024 yes slowly approaching 2025 and one thing i've learned is learning to do your own hair learning to do your own makeup learning to do your own nails like learning to do a little bit of everything on yourself is going to save you from a lot of things yes so the way you see these fingers you can see they are not equal and so are people we are all not equal so sometimes you can find yourself in situations where you don't like have money or like like you don't have enough or like time and everything but if you know to do some styles on your hair if you learn to do some simple makeup looks uh do some press on nails some waxing some you know a little if you learn to do your lashes your like it is going to save you from a lot of of things yes you can really look good on a budget so the money that you could have spent on you know saloons this and this and this and this and this you can actually just use it to buy like stuff and then do the other things yourself yes so all i'm trying to say is learning to do your own hair some simple styles learning to do your simple makeup your nails your it is like it is worth it yes so that's how my cornrows look like i have really improved with the cornrows and i like where i am going so thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel tap on the notification bell so that you do not miss out on any new videos so i went ahead and sprayed some oil yeah and that is it so make sure you improve on your gripping yes so if you are a beginner make sure to start up with small small sections of hair small corners and improving on the grip you will achieve really really neat corners bye i'll see you in my next video